people first came to Sweden about 10,000 years ago. For thousands of years, they were hunters and gatherers in the first centuries AD. They traded goods with the Roman Empire. The name Sweden comes from the warlike Svi tribe that became powerful around 500 AD. Swedes call their land Sverige, which means land of the Svi. Fika, a coffee break that normally consists of coffee or tea, cookies or sweet buns, but can also include soft drinks, fruit and sandwiches, is a social institution and an important part of the national culture. You can fika with your family or on your first date. In Stockholm, there is a speed camera lottery. The people who are obeying the law will have one of their license plates pulled in a lottery and receive a portion of the money collected from those who were speeding. A crayfish party is a traditional summer eating and drinking celebration in August. It involves boiled crayfish served with boiled potato and dill. Eaten only by Sweden's upper-class citizens and aristocracy in the 1500s, crayfish have become a national delicacy enjoyed by all, with mass importation having significantly brought down the price over the centuries. The Royal Palace of Stockholm could be considered the world's largest palace still used for its original purpose. It is slightly larger than the Winter Palace in St. Petersburg and only a bit smaller than the Palace of Versailles in France. The construction of the Stockholm Palace started in 1697 before Versailles was completed. During the 1930s, Sweden developed a welfare system known as the Swedish model. Under their system, all Swedes have access to publicly financed health care, help for the unemployed, child care, schools, elder care, and at least five weeks of paid vacation per year. Sweden annually publishes everyone's income tax returns. Technically, you can see what your brother-in-law made, your neighbor made. Making the data public demonstrates the Scandinavian tradition of Jangtangelang, or a law of Jente, which translates roughly as nobody is better than anyone else. Europe's largest shopping mall is the Nordstan in Gothenburg, with approximately 180 shops and 150 offices on 320,000 square meters, which is equal to 55 football pitches. About 37 million people visit Nordstan Mall annually. In 1974, Kim Il-sung took a thousand Volvo sedans from Sweden to North Korea and never paid for them. If Kim Jong-un and his officers rounded up all thousand vehicles and sold each of them at the current book value of about 2,000 euros, they would raise 0.6% of the debt. Green Zone or Torneo Golf Club is perhaps a unique golf course with nine holes in one country, Finland, and the remaining nine in another, Sweden. 
the border follows the Tornio River, which runs through the course. Due to its location, it is possible to play golf at any time of the day or night in full sunshine during the golfing season. Carl von Lein was a well-known Swedish botanist who invented the method for naming plants and animals which is used today. Every living thing has a Latin name that is divided into two parts. The first part gives its group or genus and the second part of the name gives its kind or species. The Minecraft world-building video game was Swedish programmer Marcus Notch Persson one-man hobby project. It is basically a digital version of LEGO. Minecraft contributed to Persson's company Mojang's 2013 record profit of 325 million kronor, approximately 39.1 million US dollars.